Hello, Zach. Hello. Nice to see you again. Of course. My name is Vince Kuhl. I'm a teaching faculty in the physics department, the assistant department head as well, um, at Colorado School of Mines. Zach Armstrong. I am a science teacher at Greeley West High School in Greeley, Colorado. When did you decide to become an educator and why? Sophomore year in college, um, I took a job as a teaching assistant for the introductory astronomy class. And in my interactions with the students was when I really fell in love with um, interacting with people, talking about science. I realized I wanted to be a, a teacher after I got the opportunity to uh, teach some sixth graders at an outdoor camp. That process of sharing it and being out in nature um, and getting students curious about the world uh, really settled it for me. And that was when I was a senior in high school, so I made the decision right after that and I went forward from there. What degree did you graduate with? Well, I got my bachelor's degree in physics and a master's degree in physics and also a PhD in physics education. Uh, my bachelor's was also in physics uh, with an emphasis in secondary education and then my master's was in K-12 science teaching. Um, it was a program designed for teaching currently practicing teachers. Now how long did that actually take you? Um, it took me three and a half years to do that master's because I did it one class at a time and then classes during the summer so it was really easy for me to get through. While you were actually yeah, in I was, the classroom? Yeah. Definitely. Okay. Uh, I took um, two years to get my master's degree um, full-time and five years after that to finish my PhD actually. <laughs> what does your day-to-day -day look like? Being partial administration within the department, um, different things come up and different questions come up from the students and from the, uh, from the colleagues that I have. So there's a lot more um, fluidity and I never know what my day is going to end up being like. Um, my day, uh, I usually teach three to six classes a day. And then in between, whenever I can find opportunities, I have to prepare my lessons and then hone them. Um, and then grade and have contact with students and parents. Um, so I'm, I'm pretty busy. What is your relationship with students like? The classes here are large. Um, it's not as much one-on-one -on -one interaction. I get a wide range of, uh, I, I know their name and a little bit about them, all the way up to, you know, I'm invited to their graduation party mm, and right, know their right, parents and right. I know lots about them. What is your relationship with colleagues like? It's collegial. <laughs> My colleagues initially, when I first started, I certainly um, had unofficial mentors who took me under their wing and actually helped me establish um, my path. Uh, my relationship with colleagues is probably one of my top reasons for coming to work every day. Uh, many of them I would consider some of my best friends. Uh, they make it really fun to be a teacher and they're some of my favorite people in the world. How much creative control do you have over curriculum? In the large classes that we teach, we have multiple sections so we have multiple faculty all working together, um, delivering the, uh, the course material. And in collaboration, we come up with an agreement on what to do. I would say in high school, it's, it's very similar. I, I wouldn't say we have 100%, but it's, it's still pretty high. Uh, we have our, our state teaching standards, which lists some things to teach and some skills to teach. Um, but those are, are pretty standard things that you would want to do anyway. Mm -hmm. uh, but then how we teach those is, is largely up to us. Mm -hmm. What do you find most rewarding at work? The interactions that I get to have with the students, with the colleagues, seeing their successes, that is absolutely rewarding. I think seeing students get curious about um, science and about anything and seeing them use the the skills that we've practiced in my class um, as a way to move forward in their in their passions um, makes me really excited and that that keeps me going I love that